In the Windows operating system, you can resize open windows on your desktop. This flexibility allows you to take better advantage of all the space available on your screen. You may find this useful if you want to keep the window open yet still have access to other information, such as desktop shortcuts, web content, or other open windows. Because of the way windows are designed, you can't resize one when it's maximized. You first need to reduce its size by using the Restore Down button. Then, simply move the mouse pointer to a side of the window border. Depending on where you place it, the mouse pointer changes to a double-sided arrow that indicates in which directions you can begin resizing. You know that Windows allows you to change window sizes to help make the best use of your screen size, so you decide to try resizing the open window so you can see more of the underlying desktop. Currently, our window is maximized. Since we can't resize a maximized window, we need to reduce its size. We can do this by using one of the control buttons to restore the window to a smaller size. Before we start manually resizing, we need to reduce the size of our icons. If we don't, we might not be able to see all of them when the window is made smaller. We can start doing this by selecting List View from the Views button menu. Notice how the icons have been reduced in size and placed into a list format. Now we can begin to resize the window. To do this in Windows, we would move the mouse pointer over the window's right border, which would change the pointer to the east-west arrow mouse pointer. We could then click and drag the border to the left or right until the window was the size we wanted. If you click Next, we'll click and drag this window's right border to the left to reduce its width. The Tasks pane is no longer in the window. It disappeared when the window size was reduced. Let's go ahead and move the bottom border up now to reduce the length of the window. Again, we'll reduce the size of the window for you by clicking and dragging its border. If we were to do this in Windows, the mouse pointer would turn into a north-south arrow mouse pointer when held over the bottom border. We need to make our window larger so we can view the Tasks pane again. To expand the window both vertically and horizontally, we could turn the mouse pointer into a northwest southeast arrow mouse pointer by placing it over the lower right corner of the border, and then clicking and dragging the corner down and to the right. Once again, we'll resize the window for you. You can see how easy it is to resize windows. Changing window measurements not only makes it easier to have many windows open at once, but it can also help compensate for different screen sizes.